Hello kittens! Silver here with Amelia the Border Collie by Douglas Cuddle Toys and we have a package that arrived today and the dog inside this package is a bit of a mystery wrapped in an enigma because I have never seen this one before. Um, perhaps there are other Douglas enthusiasts out there who are more knowledgeable than I am who can identify him but I just could not find any information on this dog online so I decided to buy him. He was really cheap and I'm very excited to see what he's like in person. I think he may be about uh, Amelia's size, which is why I brought her out for this unboxing. So we'll see if that holds true or not. So let me just open up this package and we will explore together. Here he comes, emerging head first. So I'm thinking that this dog may be perhaps um, a Bichon Frise, maybe even a Poodle. He's an all white dog, but he's, he looked really cute from the pictures. Love the little sticker that the seller included. So let me see if I can, I'll probably um, do this off camera just to make it a little bit easier on myself. So hold on one sec. Okay, the plastic wrap has been taken care of and this guy has such a sweet face. Hold on, let me just slide him out fully now. And one of the things about this dog is that he has his own little nylon collar with um, the name Meditech on it. I don't know if that's maybe a pharmaceutical company of some kind. I did not actually research that particular bit of information, but here he is. Oh my gosh, he is super adorable. And look at that. He really is about Amelia's size, even a little bit taller. Wow, I am really shocked and very, very pleasantly surprised with him. I really just had no idea that this dog had any place in the Douglas catalog. Um, really, really happy to have gotten this guy. He seems to be in great condition. He's super soft. Um, doesn't seem like he's, you know, been loved on too much. Oh, he's got a little strike right here, but, um, but this fur is in great condition still. Uh, I, I'm loving the collar that it comes sort of, uh, you know, pre-attached to him because I always end up having to buy my own collars for my plush because I always, you know, I make tags for them. Um, this one comes with his already fully equipped um, and it looks like he has a fabric nose, like a sort of like a felt perhaps. And of course, he's got those signature dark brown eyes that Douglas dogs often have. You can kind of see a little bit of that orange rim just around the perimeter. He's so, so cute, though. I really want to know what kind of dog he is. Um, let me just take a look at his tush tag. Um, I know that there's an item number on here. Uh, that didn't seem to help me too much in my searches, but he was manufactured in April of 2011, so that's quite some time ago. Um, so yeah, he was, I guess he was made specifically for Meditech. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to do some digging and try to figure out just uh, who this guy is. So he doesn't have a name right now because Meditech is no kind of name for a dog. Um, but yeah, I'm really, really happy to have him once again. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing the new dog and I'll be back again soon for some with some more plush goodness for you. Bye everybody. Just a quick update. So I put the question about the dog's identity to my Instagram following and one of my friends who is kind of an expert in all things Douglas was able to supply me with the information. So this in fact is Puffball the Bichon Frise and this is the promo version that was produced for the company Meditech which as it turns out is a healthcare company. So there were a few different versions of Puffball. There's another version that has a plastic nose and a very different face from this one. I don't have that version, but maybe someday we can scoop him up and we can do a compare and contrast. But for now, I'm super happy with this guy. And he also was freshly cleaned, so he is just sparkling and pristine now. Um, so now the case has been closed. We can all rest easy knowing that this is Puffball. So thank you guys once again, and I will catch you at the next video. Bye, everybody.